Is my boss being unreasonable? So lately I've been getting late night emails from my boss around like 11.30 pm or past midnight asking me if I can join a meeting the next morning first thing. Today I woke up to an email from him from after midnight asking me to join this meeting that's half an hour before my start time. How should I respond to this? Am I expected to join this meeting? Appreciate any advice. Yeah, so so your boss, um, your boss is knows your your work hours, and um, that's is that's really late. So they they shouldn't reasonably expect that you're awake at that time if you're getting enough rest to show up to work and be in tip top shape. So uh, this first commenter gives some great advice: uh, decline the invite with a note that you're not available at that time. That's a good one. That's a good one. I would I would go ahead and just decline. Say, hey, I'm not available at that time. I, I don't get it. Uh, you know, if you when you wake up in the morning and you see it, um, just say, hey, I'm not I'm not going to be in the office at that time. Um, in the future, if you if you need me to to be in some or something early, please give me advance notice before I go to sleep the night before. Um, <laughs> that's kind of wild. But yeah, I would just uh, decline decline the invite and just say I'm not available. Um, you don't even have to say. Um, it's before my work hours. Just say I'm not available at that time, and and then see if they can reschedule. Um, say hey, I'm uh, maybe even decline and say hey, I'm not available at that time, but I'm available at these times, um, and then and kind of give them the Uno reverse card, and put it back on them. Um, but yeah, no, if it's before your start time, if if you can't make it, and you woke up, you woke up late, um, and then maybe kind of have a conversation with your boss about, you know. You're a helpful person, you're, you, but your, your reality is, is you go to bed at X, Y, Z time. So if they send you an email after X, Y, Z time, you're not going to get it until you wake up the next morning. Um, so you're not going to be able to do anything about it and, and just kind of give them a, you know, just a heads up. Hey, I'm not, I'm not, I go to bed. I, I, I respect, just not even start with that, but I'd say, you know, Hey, I go to bed at X, Y, Z time. So if you send me an email past then, I'm just not going to be able to um, to react to it. I, I work this far away from the office and it takes me this long to get in. So when I wake up, I'm just not going to be able to make it 30 minutes early. So I'm just not. So if you need me to show up, I, I, I mean, I'm happy to be a team player. I, I can show up sometimes when I can't, when I can make it work. But you're going to need to give me a little bit more of a heads up. Let's see what the comments say. Notice that managers that pull this sort of thing never let people feel secure in their position. Oh, interesting. Um, somebody says, I use a boomerang plugin for my Gmail that has an inbox pause function. It allows me to set non email hours and even set a sort of mini vacation auto responder so that, yes, messages received after hours are on weekends get an auto reply reminder of my business hours. That's pretty interesting. Huh. Yeah, that's not bad. Um, that's not a bad idea. You know, just have an auto out of office that goes goes back and forth whenever e people email you after hours. Um, this person says that sounds completely unreasonable and crossing boundaries, but also depends on your relationship with the boss. If they are time flexible with you, as in leave early, expect any time off, accept any time off, etc. You may want to stay flexible if you feel like if you like that kind of privilege. Either way, keep your chill. You cannot control how others act or react, but you can control how you see their action, and that's what kind of my relationship has always been with my managers. So that's kind of why I had similar advice, but they said my, I wouldn't say my boss is exactly time flexible. He's very much of a works for him kind of thing. He has to do this, do that. He has a do this, do that attitude with employees and get salty when you ask to reschedule a meeting and stuff. Well, sounds like, uh, you gotta, you gotta let them know, especially if it's a recurring thing. Um, Ask constantly ask you to do tasks outside of your work hours. May have to start searching for something new. You might. So, yeah. Um, I I would I would still push back the way that I advise and all the other people advise in the chat. And if your boss kind of keeps on digging in even further, then I think that's even more confirmation that you should start looking for a new job. So that's what I'd say. Yeah. Um, not. Not an ideal situation, but I wish you the best of luck. Chasing payments, still playing in the basin while I'm working on arrangements. They heard the kid in 50 countries, thank God that's amazing. But I'd rather thank Spotify, they put me on the station.